So Samuel, we're a 165 year old company, fifth generation family owned business. We're about four and a half billion dollars in sales across North America, a little bit of China, a little bit of Australia. And we're really focused on metal industrial products. So across almost every sector, automotive, aerospace, energy, oil and gas. And we do everything from, for our customers, we provide sourcing. We can source metal from 70 countries worldwide. We can then do near net shapes. We can burn and bend and cut and forge and blank uh, near net shape metal product. And if you need a fully engineered solution, like a pressure vessel or a, an engineered tube for automotive, we can do all of that as well. So we kind of view ourselves as a company that can provide a customer a solution in metal, literally from soup to nuts, from supply chain to finished components. Pearl Oak fits in two ways. So first, as I said earlier, we're a company that supplies a solution in metal to a customer. And so Burl Oak is an extension of that. You know, there's things that you physically can't make any other way except additive manufacturing. So now we, with Burl Oak, we have the ability to go to a customer and say, you know, we can do all these traditional processes for you. We can produce a tube or a roll form part or a pressure vessel or a component. But if, if that doesn't work, we can also print something completely unique. So we, we feel like we're actually the only company in the world today that can literally deliver to a customer sourcing of metal all the way through to printing of a finished part. And we think that additive manufacturing is very disruptive. It's gonna disrupt our industry, it's gonna disrupt our customers. And so we're either on the outside looking in or the inside looking out. So we decided to enter into the business to be on the inside and try to help drive that change. I'm Colin Osborne, I'm the President and CEO of Samuel Sun & Company, and we think that additive manufacturing and Burlow Technologies is really going to be one of the cornerstones in manufacturing.